Hey, it's Tim here with Expert Power Wash, and behind me here, we got a brand new trailer belt I wanted to show you guys. Let's take a look. All right, here's the new pressure washing trailer build. Let me show you what we got here. So first off, the trailer is a Big Tex. These are great trailers. It's the 60PI model number, 6x12 dual axle, has a trailer brake. So if you're going to be pulling water, this is going to be able to carry water. It's also going to be safe with the trailer brake. Up to the heart of the trailer here, we have the brand new IGX 800. This one is fuel injected. You don't need to choke it. It's all electronically controlled. Got an easy adjustable idle system here. It has a check engine light. We turn this thing on. This one has about a half hour on it. So we just tested it. Works phenomenal. So this one here is eight gallons a minute, 4,000 PSI. Take you around to the back here. It has the OEM Honda muffler on it. Pump, if it'll focus there. It's the TSF 2021. This one is a gear drive. Got the K7 unloader. We get our machines mainly from Manatee over in Florida. Great company to deal with. Going on over here, we have a aluminum 13 gallon gas tank. Just a little tip, if you guys are gonna run these remote gas tanks, make sure you get something that's vented. Your engine won't run without your gas tank being vented. This one here, we chose to pre-plumb it for another machine. So we can put another machine in there, backup machine. This one's already ready to go. We got a bypass bulkhead already put in. This tank, while we're looking at it, this is a 325 gallon tank. Has the straps on it. This one's all bolted down through the deck of the trailer with all stainless steel hardware. So these are stainless steel fender washers, 3 8 bolts. Tank's about halfway full right now. We love the Whisper Wash 19 inch classic. These are our go-to surface cleaners for this machine. Cleans up really, really fast. All right, going around to the other side here. This is an 18 inch Titan hose reel, manual hose reel. This was an extra reel that we had, so we just put it on this trailer. This trailer is mainly gonna be for commercial. We're running a one inch manifold on this hose reel. This comes out and runs over to a Hudson float valve. So once the water fills in the tank, there's a valve in there, it'll cut it off and stop filling. All right, let me show you this cool dump valve that we put in here. So this is all inch and a half crush proof hose. It doesn't really need to be crush proof, but it's not going to get monkeyed up if uh, things get thrown on or it gets moved around. Gone over here, we have a humongous banjo ball valve. So right now it's in the up position, it's closed. We open this thing up, it's gonna probably dump this tank in minutes instead of waiting way longer Runs over to here to a uh, banjo T. So you got the dump, and then you got a one inch crush proof hose, and that runs over to the pressure washer. This right here is a banjo Y filter. This is the one inch, the end there unscrews. You can pull your filter out, rinse it all out. That'll, that'll catch a lot of your debris, to keep it out of your pressure washer pump. All right, backing up here, we have a Titan electric hose reel. I forgot to mention on these hose reels, we have the Titan stack kits. So these are stainless steel, 
three eighths bolts, all stainless bolted down through the deck. Got this on uh, both reels to bring the reels up above the uh, edge of the trailer. That's it. If you guys are looking for one of these, give us a call, 503-6185. Love to help you guys.